G'day, Ian here from FPV Power. It's going to show you our PWM in action with a trolling motor attached. Uh, we've done videos in the past with a, a light bulb just to show you the different uh, voltage controls on how dim the light goes. But now we've got an actual motor which we've hooked up and been playing around uh, at Lake Ilden testing it out. Let's just see how precise, how much of a precise control that you can have. So with the PWM, You've got your battery input and your motor output. And of course you've got your safety switch, which is a magnetic uh, man overboard switch. Once that pulls off, the motor power will cut off. So, so that's the uh, motor there. Let me put it closely. Here we go. That's full throttle. That's zero. Now let's go really slowly and see what control we can get. There we go, there we go. That's just that's nice and slow there. That is not the frequency of the camera. That is actually the speed that it's actually going at. So my fingers can follow it. See that? So that's how slow that uh, prop is spinning. And as you ramp it up, over here, now you're getting the frequency of the blades, the frequency of the camera. So it's sort of like the blade's not moving really quick, but yeah. So as you move it down, slow it down. So in the water, you can actually um, control it very, very precisely. And to the point where, that's off now, to the point where when you take the uh, this motor, this our FPV Power uh, V2, version 2 prototype of the Hobie mount, for the motors with a, with a pivoting system as you can see that's where it pivots so when you hit something your motor will pivot and then there's a tension system strap that goes around there to give the, the actual spring action so how precise you can get it so for example if your prop is in this position you're not able to take it out of the drive well because it hits against here so without putting your fingers in you can actually use the control and precisely here we go do that see how easy that was and here's a test of our PWM in the water there we go and she swims she's a swimmer she's not a sinker and there she is Beautiful. okay just uh, taken off from standstill full throttle that's the acceleration Mato. and she's off Show us the PWM. There we go. Batteries underneath the seat, nicely tucked away. Can you show us the uh, the motor just in case when it hits something? Just the action. Just yep. There we go. So that's it's basically it gives. There's a spring loaded tension there, um, and yeah, that's how it works. And at the moment, I've got a 28 uh, pound motor in there at the moment a 28 pound so let's see how she works i've got a pwm here we go hooked up to our 50 amp uh 12 volt 50 amp battery which is underneath me underneath my seat and let's see what's the speed we get up to on this thing at the moment we're doing 5.9 5.9 k's <coughs> per hour 6k 6.3 k's an hour so I call it about 6k an hour. This is I'm actually heading into the wind at the moment, um, going upwind. So 6k upwind, just a slight breeze. Uh, and of course the PWM. You can hear it. 
and I'm just turn it right off now there we go and we do have the safety switch as well which at the moment it's not attached to me it's just attached to this thing at the moment pull it off the motor stops it's the man overboard turn it off put it back on which is over here magnetic on the PWM there we go you can hear the IPM on the motor and if I pull it off continues